What's going on, everybody? Adam716 back at you with another uh, in-person recap. Um, this is uh, part two, and this will be part of the AEW. Um, it's part of the uh, video. So, um, as always, um, I do do several trips during the year, um, and this one went really, really well. Um, in the first video, I showed you the WWE section of the trip. Um, and if you haven't checked that out already, be sure to do so. Um, I think you'll like it. And uh, after that, I went and did some AEW. So All Elite Wrestling is always a great show and some really good talent. And uh, yeah. So let's see what I got. Um, I definitely got quite a few people I'd never gotten before and quite a few uh, cards done for um, all the sets I've been working on. Um, but yeah. So the first one I got... Um, it's Marina Shafir. I'm signing this women's division roster card. First time I've ever gotten her. Um, I think the only card I have her signed is when I got in a trade. But uh, glad to get her. She's really nice. My first upper deck canvas card. Uh, signed by Anna J. Um, working on this uh, this whole entire set. So definitely needed that one. Uh, main features card signed by Tay Conti. Um, she ran with a silver paint. Um, so I got it done in that instead of uh, blue, but that's okay. Need that one for the main features set. Referee Aubrey Edwards signing one of these customs that I made. Um, definitely made sure all the customs had a giant white space when they were signing, and they all hit it pretty well. My first time ever getting her um, is Tony Storm. Signed this women's division card. Um, yep, she only did one, and that was definitely cool. So, get that one. Signing 3 of 3, Mercedes Martinez. Signs AWS Legends card. Um, I think this is the... I think it might be the second one I have. I think I have Scorpio Sky in this as well. Second card for the set. Then she signed two of these women's division cards. And they came out really nice. So glad about that. Next one signed 4 of 4. It's the first time I've ever gotten her. It's Penelope Ford. Signed this GC her first card, GCW. Sign this all in card for my set. And then sign this for the AEW set. She signed that one as well. She's got a really nice autograph. Which is uh, very rare to come by anymore. So The next one is Leva Bates. Sign four of four. Signed two of these customs that I made. And signed two of these MWR cards for the set. Signed one is uh, Nyla Rose. Uh, signed that one for the AW set. Needed her on this card. I think I only need her on the canvas and the main features card now, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, Rebel Tanea signed this uh, bench warmers card. Signing two is uh, Vicky Guerrero. And an upper deck and then old school uh, best of WWE from. See, 2013. Glad to get those. Sign 3 of 3 is Sky Blue. Um, Sign this one for my AAW set. I'm slowly starting to work on. Sign two of these customs. Uh, 
Next up is Evil Uno. We had this one for the AEW set. They signed two customs as well. And I got the duel with him and Stu Grayson signed. And then this one as well. This one will be an upgrade for the set. I got him uh, last time I met him, and he signed down here in the black. You couldn't really see it too well, but this one shows up a little better. So definitely an upgrade. Uh, next is Jeff Hardy. He's always really good uh, to the fans. I um, signed a bunch of cards that I need him on. Some slam attacks. This one. Some TNA as well. I yet to get him on a TNA card, so that's pretty cool. Um, 2021 tops. This one, he absolutely gave it a really good graph. Um, definitely a PC for this. Um, and then some Road to WrestleMania inserts. 2021 tops. Uh, tops Chrome. Road to WrestleMania roster card from, I think, 2018. Not 2019. This is a 2022. This one's still got some baby powder on it. Um, but send that one. That one as well. Uh, TNA. A slam attacks. A 2022 Tops Heritage. I mean, no, that's Tops Finest. This one is an insert from Tops Heritage. Another photo, photo variation of the uh, Tops 21, I think. He's, got, he's in there like five different times. And then an art card. So super happy to get him. I hadn't met him in quite a few years. Um, but nothing's changed and how he signs. So uh, Next up is Matt Hardy, who's just like his brother. Signs a lot. Um, signed this one. Signs AD, AEW card for my set. Uh, signed a magazine card as well. As well as the uh, main features, a uh, gold parallel. I'm uh, just trying to collect the regular parallel, but I couldn't find the uh, a regular card. Um, but at some point down the line, I'm going to get him to sign one of those. Uh, also a Taps Heritage. Another one of these. An All Access card from way back. Um, WWE Action 2017 Tops WWE Aggression uh, One of these Hopefully someday I can get Bray Wyatt to complete it um, An All Access card I'm Off the Mat uh, TNA WrestleMania roster card. Um, this one as well. I think this one's uh, Championship Clash, I think, is a card. Looks really cool. Definitely a really good shot. The tops Chrome Heritage. That one. Another WrestleMania roster card. And then this one, a gold version of this card and a regular version. And then that one. Next one is Keith Lee. Signed this uh, Impact, uh, it's Undisputed card from NXT for the Undisputed collection. I've gotten this card signed before. Um, I don't know if this one's an upgrade or not, I'll have to check. It's always good to get one of those done. Uh, some of these uh, 2020 NXT cards. It's in this set quite a bit. Tops UK. 
Um, slams attacks again. Another card from that um, NXT set. Older slam attacks. Another, another older one. Twenty twenty one tops. Another slam attacks card. An older NXT. Twenty one tops chrome. Twenty twenty one finest. Tops UK. Another one of these. Let's say this is a 2020 raw, I think. 21 raw. Uh, in your house insert, which actually looks pretty nice in person. And then the 2021 Tops Heritage. The next one is the Young Bucks, uh, Matt Jackson. Signed this uh, card for the set, as well as his magazine insert. Nick signed his as well. Plus the insert card. And then sign, they dual signed this tag team's card, as well as this one. So I think all I need them on now are their canvas cards, if they have them or not. I don't have the complete checklist of the canvas cards yet. Didn't know who's in them, but definitely made a dent. Uh, next one is Kyle O'Reilly. Signed this 2021 Topps Chrome. This is the first time I've ever met him. He's a really nice guy. Uh, 2021 Topps Heritage. Uh, Topps UK Superstars. Signed one of these MWR. Actually, two of them. Uh, for the collection. So working on that set. This one for the set as well. Looks a lot better in person, but there's a signature. Uh, Tops Undisputed uh, for the set. Uh, NXT um, roster card from, I think, 2019. And the 2021 uh, Tops X Factor. Next one is the other half of Red Dragon. Um, it's Bobby Fish. Sign this undisputed card for the set. Also sign this uh, NXT. Slam Attacks. And a 2021 Tops X Factor as well. And then the rest of these are people that signed one. Uh, All Ego Ethan Page. Luther, who I was very happy to get. Um, I can never seem to pick him out. But I did get him. Powerhouse Hobbs. I can't remember if I've got him on this card already. But uh, definitely a good signature on it. Frankie Kazarian, who's very difficult to get. I was finally able to get him um, on this card. Jim Ross on this Upper Deck Canvas. Um, I think I only need him on um, a couple Undisputed cards and the base version of the AEW set. Arn Anderson, this one is an upgrade for, uh, for the card that I currently have. Isaiah Swerve Scott. Is it get him to sign this one? Brandon Cutler. This is an upgrade for this set uh, as well. He's got a very nice autograph. Always takes his time. Dante Martin. My first time ever getting him. Fuego Del Sol. Uh, it's the first time I ever got him as well. Um, I think this is the second one I have done this set. I think this is the same set as Ricky Starks that I got the last time I met them. A duel signed by Scorpio Sky and Frankie Kazarian. 
Santana, who dropped an absolutely gorgeous autograph on this card. Need this one for the set. Usually just gives you the S and like a couple squiggles, but gave a full graph. Gold Dust, um, this uh, undisputed card for the set. Um, Upper Deck Canvas card signed by Sammy Guevara. He gave a full graph on that. Anthony Bowens signed a custom. Big Show um, on his undisputed red parallel. Samoa Joe signed this undisputed card as well. Justin Roberts. Ricky Starks on his main features, gold parallel. My first autograph of Taz on this Tops, unre uh, Tops Restricted Access. Lee Moriarty for the GCW Collective set. Hook um, on this custom. He is a one per. Uh, Sunny Kiss on this card as well. Um, I didn't have her on this card. I'm slowly working on this set. I only have a couple of these cards, um, actually in my possession, um, as I wasn't able to get the set. So slowly starting to build that. Um, uh, Andrade on a, uh, Undisputed. Christian on Tops Heritage. Uh, Buddy Murphy on an NXT card. John Moxley on an upper deck set card. Uh, smudged it a little bit, but no big deal. And then Darby Allen on a limitless card. Um, always, as always, personalized and loops a signature in there, which is fine. But I'm just happy to have it in the set. So that's all for uh, part two. Um, I'll have part three. Um, next time and that should do it for uh the trip but um yeah as always don't forget to hit that like button uh, and comment if you if you'd like to i like hearing from you guys and as always if you're not subscribed already please do uh thanks for watching and i'll talk to you guys next time